what is up everybody monster fanatic here welcome back to another spin master monster jam news video there has been so many things that have been released and revealed the past couple weeks and i don't do news videos too much nowadays not as much as i used to but i still like to do them especially when i have enough news to actually get a good video out um of so i i would definitely say the amount of news that i have for you guys today is definitely well over enough for a video so i'm bringing you guys one today we have singles doubles packs we have so many to talk so many trucks to talk about and so much to show you guys so we're going to start off with a couple double packs that we have confirmed first off i think this is going to be series 25 of the double packs it could be 24 one or the other i can't really remember but here are the new double packs and uh get ready because there are a couple really cool trucks in here so we're starting off here with the crustacean and um octanator i do think that crustacean is a very clean design clean look i'm definitely going to be looking forward to getting that i will be getting that reviewing that um next is a full charge and blue thunder full charge is white now interesting it's white and purple if you guys don't know full charge is usually this hot bright pink so that is definitely a change the blue thunder body looks this, the same but that full charge has a new body which is it's pretty cool looking next is the rainbow blast versus racing stripes i think the rainbow blast uh, has like a chassis difference i think uh, just a couple of variants but this last one for this uh for the double pack series for this series at least is really cool we have grave digger and the world finals avenger from last year i cannot believe we were getting this in a double pack too um i didn't think we were gonna get this we didn't see it in singles this year so i didn't really think that they were going to do this in double packs because the past couple years they haven't really been coming out with first editions and double packs you know special designs and releases they've usually just been just variants there have been a couple exclusive like elementals and stuff to double packs but other than that nothing too exciting last couple years so this is really cool and it doesn't even stop there for the next mix after that we don't know all of the trucks in it but we do have a picture of one of the double packs and the one of the trucks in it is so awesome and here it is we have stabilizer a new variant of it taking on the red world finals jester again from last year so now we just need the blue kraken could be in the same mix honestly I, I think they should have put that blue kraken in this double pack i think that would be a lot more appropriate since they're teammates you know obviously and we still desperately are looking for the blue kraken but you know what? i will accept that as well um i know this is spin master monster so basically die cast but i want to shift off to the real monster gym world and show you guys the new spider-man truck finally revealed sort of it up close in person at some convention center somewhere overseas i believe but this is the first look we have of it in real life um this is the only marvel truck that we have seen in real life i think um i think this is going to be performing in london in a few weeks i believe and now moving on to some singles we're going to cover series thir 31 real quick so the day i'm recording this so probably the day before you guys see this mix 31 was spotted in asia and the person who spotted it was kind enough to show us the photos of all the trucks that we're going to go through room pretty rusty with some of the series that we're coming out with this year so a lot of these just look like variants to me but i'm sure all these belong in a certain series that we have this year so here we have alien invasion with a weird green chassis and red, uh, white roll cage very interesting we have a zombie which kind of looks like without, uh, one that we got a couple years ago i can't really wrap my finger around it but i feel like we've definitely gotten one similar to this i may have been like mix 16 or something I'm not sure we have this pirate curse with the mismatch uh wheels and tires and stuff i do like that series and i'm glad i'm pretty it's pretty cool they put um, pirates curse on it. i didn't think we were going to be getting any more pirates curses since the trucks basically i would consider retired but who knows still a cool truck to see some times we have calavera on these hot pink uh tires and roll cage colors pretty cool looking we have a clean variant of jurassic tack where it looks like a dark blue wheel and bkt's on it which is pretty cool i don't think the other one the first edition we got last year had bkt's on it so i'll definitely take that we have a, a once again another clean variant but this time of megalodon i think that looks pretty cool i thought it was the true heavy metal at first and I, that would have made sense but it has the blue wheels and the painted bkt's so it just will remind me of it next up we have the monster mutt golden retriever um obviously this is a fantasy this is not a real life monster mutt it's kind of like husky and and poodle now we have the golden retriever which this one looks pretty cool i do like the color of it and it's pretty simple next up we have crush cycle which is a garbage truck and i know a lot of people have always wanted a garbage truck monster truck and now we finally have one i think this one looks sick and then we have the chase piece this one's pretty cool looking it gives me hot wheels monster truck vibes it is wasabi warrior like that drastic world hot wheels monster truck series that's like what it reminds me of like the design on it and i, li I like it i mean it's not bad orange wheels but we have white walls on the, on the tires i think that's really cool don't think that's something they've ever done before actually now that i'm thinking about it and then we have two so far trucks revealed for spin master monster series 32 singles i'm going to show you the first one that isn't as crazy but definitely something to note that's 
quite interesting we have the stunt truck here first time we're getting it in the singles main line very interesting color choice here the the yellow wheels eh i mean there's no yellow on the body but they kind of ruined it with the yellow chassis thankfully i did get the superstore exclusive for this truck back in what 2020 2021 i don't really remember but i got that one i got the inverse i got the i got all of them but i will still be picking this up because it's pretty cool that they are re uh, releasing it in in the singles and the main line so i think that's pretty cool at least it has bkt's the yellow wheels wouldn't be too bad it could get away with the yellow wheels but the yellow roll cage just it ruins it and it honestly it looks like a transparent yellow roll cage which makes it even more nasty but the truck itself pretty cool looking i've always liked the stunt truck design especially that one the original and then finally we have the purple grimace i think some people call it but i'm just going to call it the grim grave digger legend this purple beautiful metallic purple it's a deep purple too a couple photos of this truck in package and out very very beautiful photos from monster mo cd thank you for these photos sir but um, that's basically y'all. I just cannot get enough of that Grave Digger the Legend. Even the painted BKTs, awesome, awesome, beautiful. And here we have a new play set that will be including Thunder Roar. So I'll probably be picking this up just for the truck. Um, This could be referencing what the Encore is going to be at Monster Jam World Finals in a few weeks. I'll let you see the video that Monster Jam posted earlier today, yesterday, when you're actually seeing this video, if you watch it the day I upload it. Um, but this is definitely a reference for what they're going to be doing in the Encore. I'll show you the video that Monster Jam posted right now. <laughs> monsterjam.com so now that you've seen the video i will note one thing this is what will be the show opener so don't worry the max d uh, 20th anniversary encore could still be a possibility we don't know yet but this will be the show opener it won't be the show closer um so who knows what they're gonna do at the end of the show i'm sure i'm pretty sure they're gonna do something special at the end of the show too we're gonna have to wait and see but yeah that will be what you, you will see when you go to world finals that'll be the first thing you see when show time starts is um thunder roars jumping nine trucks so that's gonna be pretty cool so that's definitely what the playset is referencing so definitely gonna be a cool playset worth picking up just like the stunt truck playset last year i picked that up and i don't even collect playsets but that one was pretty cool and it wasn't even anything crazy or expensive so it was pretty cool so definitely something to look forward to a lot of stuff to be looking forward to the next month or two i'd say mix 31 and honestly well i don't know about 32 but definitely 31 will be showing up in america and i'd say about august or so mid to early to mid august um is when you should start seeing a mix 31 i would say at least who knows and then the double packs i'm um, I, I would say july but we'll see thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video a pretty long news video for today um i hope this covers everything that you have been looking for news wise i haven't seen anyone else really making videos on all these cool things that have been released so hope i helped you guys out hope you guys seen something that you haven't seen yet and with that said i'll see you guys in the next video please like comment and of course subscribe if you have not already i would appreciate that it'll help me out and i'll see you guys next time peace out